a cold drawn AISI 1040 steel bar is subjected to a fluctuating axial load that fluctuates from 12 kN to 28 kN. What is the fatigue factor of safety for infinite life using the Goodman, Gerber, and Morrow criteria? This is almost a continuation to an example that we had previously solved. The link to that example is in the description of this video, so make sure to watch that one first. The link to the main fatigue failure criteria video and example 1 is also found in the description below. We know that the factors of safety will depend on the alternating and mean stresses, the endurance strength, the ultimate strength, and in the case of the Morrow criterion, the true fracture strength. As explained during example 1, link below, a reasonable estimate of the true fracture strength is 345 more megapascals than the ultimate strength. In this case, we don't need von Mises stresses, as the only existing stress is a normal stress due to the axial loading. There's a fatigue stress concentration factor that we previously calculated, and there'll be a maximum stress due to the maximum load, and a minimum stress due to the minimum load. The mean stress will be the average, and the alternating stress, the distance from that average, to either the minimum or the maximum stress. The factors of safety are therefore 1.14 for Goodman, 1.42 for Gerber, and 1.36 for Morrow. Thanks for watching.